Welcome, welcome to Ken from the Nut Car. <laughs> uh oh, already notifications coming in. What's up, everyone? Welcome, welcome, welcome to this week's Ken from the Nut Car. Usually it's Ken from the Car, but this week we are doing something special because I have all this stuff to show you from Cricut and it won't fit in my car because I'm too fat. No, I'm not, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so we're in my basement and one of my dogs just farted so it stinks, so they went outside. Um, so welcome everyone. So we have a little bit of a longer Ken from the Knot Car. That's why it's called Ken from the Knot Car. If you look in the description, it says new Cricut product, K-F-T-N-C, I think. Ken from the Knot Car. Because I tried setting this up in my car and I have all these boxes and I was like, oh no, this is not good. Like I couldn't get everything in there. So it's Ken from the Not Car. We will be in the car next week. I just couldn't fit everything in the car. It's super sad. But it's going to be like any other Ken from the car. So if you've never seen Ken from the car, first of all, let me tell you, Ken from the car has no format. It's a little all over the place. It is um, like inside of my mind and goes in a bazillion different directions. Today we're drinking Wake Up Call, which is local here to Spokane. And it is a white angel, but without, with no white milk, with chocolate milk. White, it's white milk, right? You say white, white milk? Or is it just milk? I guess just milk. <laughs> All right. So anyway, since this is a little bit different, we're going to start on me me and we're gonna talk about some sales and some other things and some you know normal ken from the car but this is ken from the not car and then i have a lot of cricket product i want to show you i was going to do this later like when sean was here but he was not interested in the cricket product like i opened it and i was excited while i opened some of it and he was like mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like he when sean is not into something he is just not into it and i'm like hey well we need to do a video about all that new cricket product i got and he's like yeah you can do that during the day Wah, wah, wah. like he doesn't want it nothing to do with it so that's why i'm doing it as part of ken from the not car yay so here's the deal who's robbie williams like the robin williams isn't he passed um okay so here's the deal is when i start showing you guys a product the camera's got to go up and it's going to point down so I have to look at your comments on the computer screen. That's a lot for me to do in a normal day because I can't focus on one thing. How am I gonna focus on three things? Like the product, that camera, and that camera. So a couple of things could happen during the show. It could just stop because I don't know, I might accidentally push a button when it's going up there. Number two, um, you know, my, my computer could go, I don't know, lots of things could go bad. Let's just start there. All right. Enough of this talky talk. Oh man, coffee is so good. I only really give myself one coffee a week from a store. I do drink coffee at my house. That is a lot of stars. Um, and yeah, so let's give you an update on the back situation. Okay, back situation, the back. So Sunday, I was, I figured out what I did wrong. Okay. Okay, so we have to go back two years here, peeps. Two years ago, I was in a lot of pain, uber amounts of pain, and I finally went to a, uh, a new chiropractic. And I didn't know this was like a, an alternative chiropractic. I went into the office, I was like, hey, I need, I need you to address me. And they're like, ooh, we do things a little different here. And I was like, well, what do you mean? And so they sit down and they basically say like, your body's in balance, and when your body's out of balance, it creates problems and blah, blah, blah. And so we make one adjustment on your neck and that's it. And it takes like a couple months, but then you were going to be good as new. And I was like, this person is a witch doctor. Like, did she even go to school? Does she have a degree on her wall? Like I'm looking around the office like, okay, this is legit. But I was like, I'll try it. What's the harm, right? So I went there and you have to go literally every other day. So they make, I'm not even kidding. You lay on a, you lay on a table like this, right? And there's this little part in your head that lays like here. They push here and then this thing goes like this and falls. And then your head goes bleep. 
no pop, nothing. And they're like, all done, go sit in a chair. And you're like, I just wasted $100 on this place. Like they pushed on my neck. Hoax, you know, like this is a fraud. Like we need to report this stuff. Well, you go back every day and check to see if you're in balance. And they, they sit you on a table and they make you turn your head left and make you turn your head right. And they'll be like, you're out of balance or you're in balance. Legit. I was like, this person is cuckoo. And after about a month, I was like, okay, maybe it's placebo, but it's kind of working. And then it got to the point where I didn't need any more adjustments. They're like, you're in balance. And you go like, you try to stay in balance for like a couple days and then a week and then a month. And so I was in balance for like three, four months. And so I forgot kind of what it felt like to be out of balance. And so on Sunday, back to the whole point of this story. So on Sunday, we are going to the Chalk Couture Convention. We're making t-shirts. I'm weeding the t-shirts, but I had my feet up like on a stool. And it kind of hurt Sunday night. And I woke up Monday and I thought, oh my God, Satan is in my back. Satan has arrived. He's in my back. This is no bueno. I couldn't even get up. Like I literally got a bed. I felt like Yoda. I'm not even kidding. Like I was bent over. I, I pictured a cane. I was like going around my house, talking to my dogs, going, mm, yes, penine, and you know, stuff like that. Like it was bad. And so I was like, Sean, it's the end for me. Just take me out to pasture, put me down. Like, I don't know what's up. Like this pain was horrible, went down my back. So yesterday was Tuesday and I was like, we're going full force. We're going to do, you know, massage. We're going to go to everything like and then I was like oh my gosh I wonder if I'm out of balance like it didn't even occur to me like I was like I'm gonna go to acupuncture I'm gonna go to Cairo I'm gonna do all this crap you know and so I was like maybe I'm out of balance so I went to my chiropractic guy or girl and they did their thing they put me on a the table they say turn your head left right and they're like oh you are so out of balance and I was like I am and they're like yeah it wears your pain I said lower back and they said your hips so they looked at me and they're like this hips up and this hips down so you're out of balance that should be even so seriously, I, um, Alicia Walter, I'm so sad I know that your show, um, that is not true. So for that comment that just came by about the mystery box, that's not, not true. I'm sorry, you got incorrect information. I can kind of explain that in just a second. That'll be my next story. Okay, so, so they adjust me. I don't care if it's placebo. I don't care if, like, they put a spell on me. I don't care if they're witch doctors. Instantly. Not 100% pain-free, like I'm 85. I'm sure it was a combination of acupuncture, massage, everything, but I'm like 85% better. But that 15% still sucks. So, pain, there we go. First story has nothing to do with what we're talking about today. <laughs> Second story, so I just saw a comment about the mystery box, about um, the mystery box is going away. That is so not true. I can, we got permission, I think, to say this. If not, I'll get in trouble. But here's the thing about the mystery box. So the mystery box comes out usually every Tuesday, right? Or every Tuesday of the first month. Well, here's the deal. Um, we, as many of you know, if it's a really good mystery box, within seconds, we, um, it's a penguin and bears. I don't get it. Whatever. Um, so when the mystery box comes out and we, myself, Melody, Lori, Carol, all the other people that Auntie Tay do mystery box videos, everyone floods the Cricut site and they get like serious numbers into the Cricut and it breaks Cricut. It literally breaks the site. They can't do anything. They can't track orders. It's a big customer service nightmare. So we had a conversation about it and it is coming back, but they're waiting for the system to get upgraded to handle the traffic. So they don't want to, um, they don't want to have all of these people having a horrible customer service experience because it is horrible. I mean, everyone goes, they can't figure out who's, you know, orders. And then all of a sudden you guys are contacting us and saying, I can't get in. I got that dreaded 404 and it's bad. And I feel bad for the chat reps and cricket because then they're dealing with customer service nightmares because all of a sudden people have 15 mystery boxes coming to them and stuff. So they're fixing the system. It will come back. I don't have a date. I don't have like a, here's when it's happening, but it will come back and they do want it to come back. They just are trying to get it to where it's seamless. And I get it because all of us go live and we're like, oh my gosh, you guys, it's going to run out like super quick. Go, go, go. And <laughs> it literally within seconds, like you guys all know, you get the little spurning circle of death and you're like, that's it. I'm not getting this box. And then all of a sudden you're like, nope, didn't complete the order. Didn't complete the order. Didn't complete the order. And then it just fails. So yeah. All right. 
So sales, I see questions are coming in that are like, get to the point, Ken, get to the point. What, what's the new items? We don't need to hear about your back. Oh, how funny, the next question was, how's Kim's back? <laughs> All right, so I told you guys, these are, I am not focused today at all. So sales, Cricut. So this, this Ken from the Not Car is two things. One is for Cricut, uh, new items, but the other is these sales. So the sales right now are actually really good. They have Cricut vinyl and Cricut iron on. So this is not the new stuff, which we'll talk about in a second. This is the um, stuff that's always been on their site. It's 40% off. Plus, you can use my code KK10, so it essentially makes it right around 48% off, almost 50. Um, so that is the number one sale that is awesome. So definitely take advantage of that. Oh, there is cardstock, $4.99. Glitter cardstock, regular cardstock. Um, I think there's shimmer cardstock. I gave you the links down below. Take advantage of the cardstock because with the 10% off, it brings it down to like $4.25 if you're an access member. Brings it down to like $4, okay? That is insanity. And I forgot everything else. So we have to pull up my notes because that is inside Ken's mind. I don't, where's my email? Oh, there it is. There's the, hello. Well, maybe I can't get into my email. This iPad, this is the second generation iPad. You would think it would have issues. It does, it does. Maybe I need to update it. Well, I don't know, let's see. What else was on sale that I saw? Mm, there was something else that I feel like, ooh, tools, mat, and blades are 30% off. So once again, 30% off, plus if you're an Access member, plus if you use KK10, you're getting a really good deal. So you need to check the, the sales and use them. Um, I don't know this, their sales usually start Wednesday morning at 12.01 and go through Tuesday night. So the sales should go through the week. Um, there's eight, thank you, uh, Tisha Van Dyke. There is 8.99 carts, or not carts, like not a pushing shopping cart, like cartridges. And those, there's limited quantities of those. So yes, my code still gives free shipping. Hi, Sean. Um, so check that out. Check out, um, all the sales down below. There is also some good stuff at Amazon. So Cricut on Amazon is still like around 25 to 40% off for random things. Silhouette has a Silhouette Mint for 35 bucks. The whole intro package, which is crazy. The Xyron store is on sale, which is crazy. Um, so all those links are down below. Use those links because the, the, you are missing a, a lot. What am I missing, Sean? Oh, okay, here's the deal, Sean. I have lights and they're gonna come on in a second. But if I turn the lights on now, it highlights the sweat dripping off my face. Thank you for bringing attention to that, Sean. I was trying to avoid that. But now everyone knows, now I have to get my sweat towel out because you had to bring a focus to it, Sean. Sometimes I swear, now my hair is messed up. That's the reason I don't want lights on, Jonathan. <sighs> Even when he's here, he's interrupting my lives. Or not here. Shouldn't you be working? What time is it? You should be working. Okay, my AC's up. I don't know why. As soon as I go live, I sweat. <laughs> like During the rest of the day, I'm not sweating, but I go live. Maybe it's adrenaline or I'm excited to see all of you. I don't know, but I sweat. No more, it could be the coffee. Mm, who knows? Um. All right, so sales. I've already forgotten all my sales. <laughs> so let me go look. Um, I have to go look at my email. I think that's really all the sales for Cricut. I don't believe there was anything else um, for Cricut. So just check all the links down below. Take advantage of it because these are really, really good sales, okay? So, and it supports me when you use those links. And this is a kind of a rough month. I'll be honest with you. It's, uh, so Chalk Couture has a big convention coming at the end of the month. So no one's really buying Chalk Couture because they're kind of waiting to see, which I get. Summer months are kind of slow anyways. So I'm like, Sean, we might have to sell our house. <laughs> Poor Sean. Like, I'm not the type of person that's like, let's just see how it goes. Have faith it will work. Like the first day I feel like, oh my gosh, we didn't make enough money today. I'm like, that's it. I'm going to go work at McDonald's. We're selling the house. We're going to have to find a townhome for the dogs. Like, <laughs> like I go worst case scenario all the time. <laughs> So bad. All right. So that is, I think that's everything sales wise. Um, okay. Here's everything. I have it up now. 
$8.99 cartridges, 40% off vinyl, 40% off iron-on, 30% off mats, blades, tools, and $4.99 cardstock. So use those links, go, go check it out. All right, we're getting to the new product. When I was a kid, I used to take stuff like this and go like this, and I thought I was that guy from Big. You know, like you go look in the, you go look in the um, thing and he does the little fortune, he goes and gives them fortune, that's what I thought. That's your random fact of the day. <laughs> All right, so we are gonna now move the camera. For those of you who get seasick, well, I guess air sick, bone movie sick, movement sick, motion sickness, motion sickness. For people that get motion sickness, you might want to look away because I have to move the camera from there to up there because I didn't use Switcher Studios or anything fancy like Sean likes to do. Also, I think the reason why people aren't getting notifications is because of Switcher Studios because I did this on the regular app and Ken from the cars get tons of like people like, I got a notification, I got a notification. I think when it goes through Switcher Studios, something happens. I do. I really, really do. Zoltar. Zoltar? Oh, Zoltar! Yes! That was his name. All right. Okay, so we're going to go, and we're going to switch the cameras. So, um, it's going to get a little fuzzy-wuzzy here. They say it doesn't. Of course, Switcher Studio says it doesn't. What are they going to be like? Yeah, that's us. We're, you're not getting notifications because of us. Because then everyone would unsubscribe. Those dogs are barking, and I am telling you. Debarking them. All right, I'm moving the camera. Un momento, por favor. Do you want me to sing to you? Da, da, da. Oh, wait. I should probably move the camera. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hold on, guys. Hold on, peeps. Look, there's the turtles. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're doing good. I know you guys aren't too sick, but wait, there is more. Just a sec. Ta-da! <laughs> you guys are all probably like, what is happening? Where is Sean for the professionalism? Because this is what you get with... I'm going to move some stuff out of the way so you don't see as much. Get my sweat top. There's my turtles. Better. Lights are key. Thank you, Sean. You guys see what I have to deal with? Everyone's always like, oh, Sean's so nice. And then literally he picks me apart. He's like, ooh, just watched your video. That sucked. Ooh, I just watched it. You need to stop touching the camera. Ooh, I just watched it. You need to stop doing this. He's very critical. Very critical. I just would like you to know that all. You guys all love him. He is mentally abusive. Okay, so, you guys ready? So, I don't know which box to start with. So, I got a, I basically got a haul. I don't know why it's called a haul. Haul. Because, like, you haul stuff? Probably. So, let's start with this box. So, I got a lot of stuff from Cricut, and I want to open it because Sean didn't want to open it with me. And I'm still monitoring comments. I, you can see my computer right there. You can see my sweat towel. We'll put that, we'll hide that with the turtles. Drink of coffee. All right, so I'm using my pen blade. And a lot of this stuff is brand new. Um, and I gave you all the links down below. I kind of know what's in it because it tells you here. It tells you what's in it. Which is kind of like, it kind of ruins, you know, Christmas. Because then you're like, ooh, let's... So, but I kind of know what's in it. So I gave you the links down below. Oh my gosh, you guys. There is new Cricut cardstock. There's a Zootopia. There's a Moana. There is Spider-Man, Minnie Mouse. I'm missing one, I think. Zuto oh, and, and Finding Dory. Okay. What is... Ooh. Ooh. This is huge. Threw that over there. This is the rotary kit. So what, is, what does this all come with? So this, I don't know. Oh, it tells you. This, oh wait, that's upside down for you guys. This comes with a rotary cutter, which is this. It comes with an 18 by 24 self healing mat and a 12 by 24 acrylic ruler. Ooh, this is really good for like, 
I love this. If you have not used, if you've not used the rotary cutter, it is so impressive. Okay. I was going to try to be careful cutting this, but then I realized it's a self-healing cutting mat. Wow. Pen blade, you're kind of not happy right now. Wow. Oh, this is an old one. Just sec. Is it glass or self-healing? Well, you know what? Um, maybe they know I drink coffee and it doesn't want me to hurt myself. Okay. So this is acrylic. It's got plastic on it. How do you, oh my gosh, this is hard. Okay, okay, people. Okay, okay. How, am I not normal? Oh, there we go. So you would use this with the rotary cutter, but it's not, this one's not, this one's not so cute. Well, it's acrylic. Let's read what the package says. Okay. So the 12 by 24 acrylic ruler, quickly cut material to fit your Cricut machine mat, frosted finish for visibility on light and dark materials, measurement marks in 1 8 increments, angled lines at 30, 45, and 60 degrees. So, I guess these are 1 8 increments. I just call them little lines. Like when I'm measuring something, which I don't think Sean likes, but I just say go to two and one, two, three, four, five lines. <laughs> That's how I do it. This is the self-healing cutting mat. So this, mm, this is what I'm super excited for because this is where you can actually take a blade right on it and cut and it's, it heals itself. So it's on both sides. There is the blue and the dark side. It also has your degrees and it's got two times the self-healing cutting. So it basically what that means is they, they did it with others on the market because after a while, self-healing cutting mat will dull. Um, but this is like, if you're cutting fabric and you go through it, it self heals. It doesn't, it doesn't leave that, which is really cool. And then this is super sharp. I already have one of these. I don't know where it is. Let me go see if I can find it. Oh, I just open this one. Okay, so this I've already used and I love it. I used to be obsessed with watching unboxing videos because I love the sound of people like opening packages. I'm sure I'm not the only one. So what I like about this is it has a protective blade. See? So then that's the blade is now you can cut. And even though, you know, you're cutting into this, it's self-healing. And then when you're done with it, you push and it's now to where you can't hurt yourself. See? But if you have this on, so this goes... Do not, blade, ouchie, no, no. But then you push that, good to go. Here, I'll show you on this side, see? Let's get real close to the camera. See, there's the blade. See? All right, so that's the first thing, that's really cool. This is, you can buy all these separate, which I think that's what's in these boxes, let's look. So this box, I bet you, uh-oh, that just fell in. So this box, I think, has, oh, I could just rip it open. Hey, do. What's this? Huh? Oh, it's a little guy. Oh, wait, no, it's the same size, right? <laughs> That's the same size, right? I think it's the same size. It is the same size. So I have two of them. So nearly two times self healing material. Let's see here. Double sided with large, easy to read numbers. 12 by 12 and 12 by 24 marks Cricut match mat size. Oh, that's what those are. OMG, that's so cool. I'll be right back guys, I'm gonna grab a mat. Oh no! Well, those all fell. Yep. Hope you're happy there. Well, you 
you have got to let go. Okay. Okay, and let's grab this. All right. That was a lot of work. Look at that. So that is perfect. So if you're cutting fabric, these blue lines, can you see it? Those blue lines, can you see them right there? So there's a blue line here and a blue line there. These are 12 by 12. So for like, if you're cutting something for your mat and then that one's 12 by 24, that is brilliant. Alrighty then. So we got that. Sean, you're gonna have a mess to clean up. Ooh, another box. What's this? Whoa! How big is this one? Whoa, that sounded dirty. I didn't mean for that to be dirty, guys. Holy guacamole! Look at that! Wow! So this guy, oh my, this, this requires some coffee drinking. So we can see, as you can see, you know what, that was something Sean used to always give me corrections on. I'm telling you guys, he's rude to me sometimes. He would always say, you say as you can see too much in your videos. Well, listen here, Sean. Okay, so, nearly two more. So this is the same thing, it's just it's just bigger, right? So this, let's show you a size comparison here, peeps. So here is this one. You can see the difference. Look at that. <gasps> and this one has this, you can do your 12 by 12 mat this way. Or no, this would be a 12 by 24 mat. 12 by 20 format, 12 by 12, 12. This one is for quilters, for sure. I just spit on it, sorry about that. Oh my gosh. I could use this now, really to, because I bet you it cleans up really nice too. I mean, you wouldn't want to use like inks and stuff because it would stain it probably. But it's nice because you have, so what you have here, look, I think I'm getting this. I'm not a sewer, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to be one. So you could put, your fabric, you can even line this up with this because you have a nice line there and then take your rotary blade like that. So all of the links are down below with the prices. So you can look at the Cricut store to see how much they are. Um, I would say if I was going to buy one, I would buy the kit that comes with this because you're going to get, I want to say it's $69 because you get the rotary cutter, the acrylic and the 18 by 24. And then this guy or girl, I don't want to be sexist, this guy or girl or pansexual or whatever they're called, um, or that's not the right term, you guys, at all. <laughs> oh, it's a rough, rough go. Um, okay, so very cool. I'm going to open our next box here. Okay, so this is the next box. So what's in here? This one doesn't have a list. I've been waiting to open this and I wanted to do it with, you know, my lovely partner, but I just don't think he's interested in this stuff. Um, wow, that's really on there good, everyone. Um, don't cut yourself, don't cut yourself, don't cut yourself. Whoa. We got more. We have an easy press mat. Everyone knows what an easy press mat is, which I love. Love it, love it, love it. Whoa, 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 George. He loves the big one, George. That's not this type of show. All right, heavy chipboard. So, okay, I have to make a comment on this. So, I had that person reach out to me, very upset with Cricut. If you're watching, I've already responded to you, but upset because they bought chipboard and they said that the Explore will not cut it, even with the deep cut blade. That is true. So if you buy this chipboard for, from Cricut, this is specifically for Maker. And um, you, I don't think even with the deep cut blade, it's gonna work. 
Like, because this is a very, very heavy mat board. We're talking heavy. So you have to have the maker with the knife blade to cut this. I wouldn't even try the deep cut blade in the Explorer because it's just not gonna work. Because even with the knife blade, it took me a couple passes. To, well, we did it live. It's amazing stuff, but it, it's, yeah. Ooh, look at this cute little thing. So this one is just the standard 12 by 12. Look at this cute little thing. So really, we can put up, oh, another acrylic ruler. So we could put, okay, to show you all the sizes. So we have the Monster, which is 36 by 24. This one is the 18 by 24. And this one is 12 by 12. So you can see the sizes there. Look at that. This one's so nice. You guys, it almost takes up my whole workstation. Wah, 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 wah. Look it. For reference, these are turtles. See how little the turtles are compared to this? So the turtle on a 12 by 12 mat. Here you go. This is your reference. See? Okay. Two turtles on this one. But on the big one, four turtles. Wow. And I'm going to do a test because I have other self-healing cutting mats. And I'm going to see if it is two times. You guys like, you know me, I like to compare everything. All right. I have one more box, but this box is heavy. Now, I will let you know that this box I repackaged with a lot of stuff because it was, oh, I forgot about this little guy. <laughs> That was like a bonus. That's like a Twix bar. You eat one Twix bar and you're like, oh my gosh, there's another Twix bar in there. That's what that was like. All right, where's my other map? Welcome to the 10 from the basement random show. All right, let's move all this stuff out of the way. <laughs> uh oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, all right. Move that out of the way. All right. I had to get a little bit more coffee. Whoo! Hi, Sean. All right, so here is this box. So let's open this box. Now, I kind of know it's in this because we got kind of alerted to it. But I'm super excited because everyone's been asking me questions on this stuff. All right, so I'll put this off to the side and we'll kind of go through it. So the first thing is these here. These are the fusible Oh my gosh, these are making fun of me. They say that they're fusible fabric fat, six. I am not a crafter, what does that mean? Why are they fat? They're probably, oh, these poor little fabric guys probably think they're fat. Now they're gonna wanna go on a diet. I don't get it. Cut out desired shape. So these are the fusible fabric. So essentially what these are, cause everyone's been asking what these are. These are where you can cut them off cut them on your machine. I would cut them on the maker. You could possibly cut them on other machines um, because they are back. They, they have the, they're fusible. So basically, you know how in the old days people would always say, hey, can I cut fabric on my Cricut Expression or my Cricut Explore? And everyone would say, yes, you can. Just make sure you use the right blade and make sure it's, it has, it's been fusible. So what that means is there's a fusible backing on here. If you, you touch it, it kind of feels like, um, it's not sticky, but you can tell that there's an, an adhesive on there. So you can cut this on your machine and directly iron it onto like a shirt, a pillow, pants, anything really. Um, there's been debate on whether you need to sew around it or not. I don't sew around mine because it's got the adhesive on it. Some people like to add the sewing around it to give it that really good kind of um, look, I guess, the sewing look. I don't know what you want to call it. But this one here is the, I already ripped it off. I think this color 
was the pastels. So you have like the blue, so this one. So they have a whole bunch of different colors. This is the Blake. I always wanna call her Blake Lively, but it's not, that's an actress. This is Riley Blake. See, isn't her name Blake, Blake Riley or is it Blake, it's Blake Riley, right? Isn't that the one that Hottie Patati is married to? So that's weird. Maybe it's the same person and that's her like undercover name. So, Blake Lively, oh, okay. So you also get this really cute lemony color and this salmon color. I would call this pink, but then Sean would correct me and say it's salmon. Salmon. So, you want me to zoom me in? Oh boy. There you go. Zoom me in. I need more light? I don't know how to do that. Maybe I do. Just a sec. Just a sec. My, my crew has spoken. That's all I can give you. <laughs> That's it, people. That's it. That's all the light you get. All right, so this is the pastel colors. And this, I definitely, I mean, you could, you know what? I would say, like, well, let's see what the site says. Let's get my iPad and see. So these are fusible. So let's search fusible. Hello, fusible. I don't see why you couldn't use like your Explorer on this with like a fabric blade because it's fusible. So it's almost like it's backed, like which we did. Yep, use with all Cricut cutting machines. So most people, if you have the maker, it would be perfect. Look at this Halloween color. <gasps> Look at it, you guys. Wouldn't that make such cute stuff for Halloween? So yeah, you can cut this with all of your Cricut machines. Maker, Cricut Explorer, all of that good stuff. And the, the Cricut Explorer has a dial on there that says fusible fabric. So this is cute, that's the pastel. This one, if I remember right, is the bright, I think. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh, see it says, see that's where I think I was confused. Perfect for use with the Cricut Maker, which it is, you could, but you you could definitely, if you have the, the Explorer, um, you could do it. Um, I don't have the expressions anymore. I haven't cut fabric ever with the expressions. Maybe I did a long time ago. So I can't speak to that, but you could definitely do it with the Explore. So this is the bright. So you get, it's a little lighter of a pink. So there's the salmon. You can see the colors in the pink and you get this cool purple. Oh, look at that. And it's almost got this distressed look. So pretty. I bet you that's the orange in the Halloween set. Look. So these currently are brand new, so you wouldn't be able to use my code on it, but like I always say, what's new soon will be old and we'll be able to use codes on it. But there's a lot of them. I'm gonna be making projects with this because I don't sew. I really, really need to teach myself how to sew. So for me, this is a perfect, this is so cute. I wonder if someone actually ties this or is this a machine because that's a, a lot of work. So this one is the neutral set. I can't find this one on the website. Maybe I just don't know where it's at, but you have like a chocolatey brown and wow, look at that. Look at how much my light changes on those colors. Whoa. All right. So then you have like a khaki, a foresty green, and then this really beautiful cream color. So let me see if I can kind of, let's do, so we have, let's show you the colors getting this teal. A nice gray. This is a really pastel yellow, almost like a, um, um, uh, I don't know, I mean really light canary color. Salmon. I'm making up these names. They probably are called something else. This is a really bright red, bright orange, bright purple, bright pink. There's the cream, green, khaki, and brown. And on the website, just so you guys know, because I'm gonna be ordering more of this, because once again, I'm, I will use, like I'm not like a sewer, but this is awesome. But on the website, there is all different, oh, come on iPad. There's all different colors. Like this one is, 
the holidays, so you got like Christmassy colors, and I know that light above is kind of annoying. But see, so you got stripes and dots, all sorts of stuff. And they're $12.99 retail. But you also get your access number if you're in access. You get your 10%. All right. If you guys have had questions, I'm so sorry. I'm trying to monitor them, but that was really pretty stuff. So my mind kind of went a weird way. All right. You guys already know this isn't like super new. It's still new to me. I've used this. I will go show you an example. I'll be right back. So this is the uh, pattern, basically iron-on or HTV. So all of them have three different designs in them. And I'll tell you the names and stuff, but these are cool. That's how I made this shirt. So everyone's been asking, how did you get, um, that light is really bright. Let me turn off that light so you can see the, the, the texture in there. Hopefully that was better. If not, then my iPhone can't figure it out. Nope, it can't. I'll turn back on those lights, but see, look at the different, you really can't tell with this phone. I swear to you, it is beautiful. It's different colors. So, um, very cool stuff. Let me turn back on the lights so you can see them up close. So this stuff you still have to mirror. So you're still gonna cut, so for example, let's open this package. I cut, I'm not kidding, 31 of these this weekend for my chop convention coming up. And it was super easy. This stuff weeds beautifully, by the way. So when you open it, you're gonna see the, um, the carrier sheets on the bottom here. So, man, we got a lot of tape to go through, don't we? They wanna make sure that this does not unravel. So, here's one piece. So the carrier sheet, which is what you're gonna be able to press on, is the sh what you see so shiny. The apple, and then the bottom still has the sticky. So you would still put this with the, the shiny. When they say shiny side down, it's because this is the shiny like this and cut it. But look at these designs. Oh, oh my gosh. I don't have time to open them all. Maybe I do, I don't know. I have an appointment at 345. It just turned three because my clock dinged at me. But look at these designs. I think this is an Anna Griffin. Yes, this is Pattern Iron On Anna Griffin. And this one is called, I don't know. Oh, Charlotte Sampler. Oh my gosh, look at that black and white. <gasps> look at it, you guys. That is gorgeous. Ooh. That is really, so this is all, um, I love this pattern stuff. I didn't, I've, I didn't use it until I started making these uh, chalk tour shirts and it's so easy to use and it weeds so easy um, and it fuses right on the shirt. You don't have to add anything. So this one here is the Natalie Milan Sunset Blossom. Let's open it. Why not, right? When in Rome, I got time. So this one is the Sunset Blossom. I also give you the link down below because I don't have all of these yet. Um, just because, you know, it's been a hard month, like I said. <laughs> it's like kind of saving money. But this... She has um, the blue, which is what I use for um, the, uh, I just don't want to cut all the way through, but that tape without nails, because yes, I know I bite my nails. Don't bite your nails, Ken. Get a manicure, Ken. <gasps> Ooh. Dude, can you imagine for like a um, race, a, a, a pink race, like the, for breast cancer? Ooh, look at this one. It's like a sunset. And then this one's kind of like a watermarky pinks, got light pinks and dark pinks in there. So really pretty. Um, this one looks like it's all blues. This one is the Filgury Blue Sampler. So this one here looks like it's gonna be all 
kind of blue colors. And some of them are designers, some are just Cricut. So it depends on what you're looking for. I know that um, Anna Griffin has a whole bunch of different styles that match kind of her fabric. If you guys don't know that Anna Griffin does fabric, she does. That's kind of what she's known for. And this one's all kind of blue patterns. Look at this. Wow. That is gorgeous. Look at that. So there is a lot. I won't open them all just because I think I'll run out of time. Unless you guys want to see them all. What time is it? Oh, we might be good. Aren't they pretty? I agree with you. I wasn't, I, I didn't know if I was gonna like it, but now that I've used it a lot, it's awesome stuff, you guys. So this is definitely floral, 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 man, floral? Patterns from Anna. Anna, 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 Anna. Do you guys remember that show? I loved that show. Every time I hear Anna Griffin, I think of that. Anna, 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 Nicole, she's so outrageous. You guys are like, what are you talking about, Ken? Look at that. Ooh. Wow. This one's one of my favorites. So this one, um, I can't find on the Cricut website, and I've looked in a few stores, so maybe they haven't released it. I bought it one time on Cricut, and then I've never seen it since. And it's like masculine designs. I think Joanne's had it. Let me cut this one out. And I love this. Look at that. You saw the red and black at Michael's? Oh, only at Michael's. Perfect. Look at this. This is like a wood texture, black and white. You have the white and black, and then the, the, the buffalo plaid, which if you guys don't know, buffalo plaid is hugely popular. This is another Anna Griffin. This one is called In Bloom Pink. Wow. You guys, these are so pretty. I was so sick of looking at the teal. I had the teal pack. And the, the teal pack is um, what the my Chocotour shirts are going to be made out of. And I was so... But... Sean and I, we did 31 of those this weekend. Took us forever. Look at those, you guys. And look how they lay flat. That's what I love about it. Like, it's not curling up on you, so, and it's really good. And weeding, I, I was impressed on the weeding on this. It, it was really easy to weed. It wasn't, um, like, you know, sometimes you work with iron-on and it, it's kind of got that sticky feel to it. This doesn't, it just comes right off and it fuses beautifully so this one's all black and white so this one's got kind of kind of reminds me of comic strips look at that so this one's got some leaf patterns this has got kind of a chevron well distorted chevron and then little arrows and stuff so these actually, I bought a lot of these at Joann's when they first came out. So a lot of people started in the Facebook group saying, hey, there's this pattern iron on and Cricut didn't even have it. And so I wanted to, I did show it in a video a long time ago. Gosh, these came out a while ago now. And I haven't been able to get the entire collection just because there is some that are exclusive at only certain places. Um, but... Now that I've used it, I'll be using this a lot more. So you have the fusible fabrics that you could do like an offset. Like, how, what, wouldn't that be cool? Like you do like a, a shadow of it under the fabric and then use the pattern. But you have this, look at that. And this light pink. And we have one more and then I'll show you the other stuff in my box. I got some time peeps. 
I told you this would be a long one. Ooh, this one's kind of like party themed. Look at that. Little kind of like some confetti. Pink and white dots. And then these are little like starbursts. Hi, Sean. Bye, Sean. See you in a few minutes. So look at all that. How fun. So that is the, the um, pattern iron-on. I also get a lot of questions sometimes about the difference between iron-on and HTV. It's the same thing. Companies just call it different. So Cricut uses the work term iron-on. Other people use HTV. So, all right. So we have fusible fabric. We had the beautiful printable. And then let's show you guys this stuff next. So this is the premium vinyl. So I know this is in store at Michael's and it's also um, on Cricut website now. And this is removable. And what I love about this, you guys, is it's flat. I know that's something silly and to some people, but to me, I love vinyl that comes in 12 by 12 sheets. I don't have to cut it and it's flat. And what I love about the new stuff, so this is the new, like I was saying earlier, like iron-on and, and vinyl are on sale. This tells you, look at that. So you know, look. So all the new stuff tells you on the back. So this way you're not confusing your iron-on with your, um, your vinyl. And then it tells you, so this is the premium vinyl and this is the removable. It's got the grid on the back and it is way, Wow, that feels completely different. That's gonna weed really nice, you guys. So this one comes with kind of our darker color. So we got, looks like in this one we have black. There's like a, a maroon or a dark wine color. There's this beautiful navy and this gray, and then this really nice stark white. Once again, it tells you. So if you have limited space to put all your stuff and things get mixed in, you're gonna know right away. You don't have to you know, feel it or come up with an idea of, okay, what is this? It tells you right away. And these are the ones, only ones right now, they do have rolls of the premium, which I'll show you in just a sec. But this here is the ones that are the 12 by 12. So they're nice and flat. This one you got your white beautiful gold, red, <gasps> look at that blue, it's like a royal blue. You know what, I bet you, and this has got all the colors, but I bet you, I'm opening all these packages and I bet you that's what's in here. <laughs> yep, removable premium vinyl. So let me just open this, it'll probably have all the colors. Well, maybe. So we got white, we have uh, white, this gray color, a nice cream. Look at that gold, oh, that's gorgeous. A nice chocolate brown. We have red, ooh, look at that orange. You can tell this has a different feel from the regular vinyl. I'm gonna have to do a comparison of their normal vinyl compared to the premium vinyl. It definitely has a different feel to it. Um, it it's very comparable to some of the uh, popular brands that you would find on the market like Oracle, I feel. Like this one is, it's, yeah. I mean, it, it has a different feel to it. And these colors are gorgeous. Wow. These are the indoor and they're removable. So the outdoor vinyl, I think I have a roll in there, I'll show you. Um, but it should tell you, of course, on the pack what you have. But this would be the premium removable vinyl and I would say indoor. Now, outdoor, if you're under like an awning or something would be fine. But this I would, uh, I would personally say I would just do it um, indoor. So, Let's see, it looks like they gave me, let 
Ooh, I have like 15 minutes, guys. So here is, so this is premium vinyl, lays flat, easy to weed, apply, remove without residue. So it looks like it's the same colors. It's just, this is in the rolls and this is a matte finish. So it looks like we have some good colors here. And I think this is all premium vinyl. Premium vinyl, premium vinyl. Yeah, this is all premium vinyl. So none of this, I don't think this is the outdoor or this is all removable. None of this is the, the permanent stuff, you guys. This is all like removable. So this is the stuff that you can get at Cricut right now. There is some that have, um, uh, sampler packs. I wanted to see, so this color here, which is called just orange matte. So it says it lays flat. Let's test that. Cause that's the reason I kind of like the flat stuff is I don't like it rolling up on me. So let's see if this lays flat. Let's move all those up to the top. Wow. It doesn't curl up. Look at that. If you go that way, it does. But look at that. Oh, and then look at removable premium vinyl. Oh, upside down. Sorry, guys. Once again, it's all marked with the grids. Very cool. So this is orange. What other colors do we have here? This one is midnight blue. This one is a variety pack cottage sampler. It's got all of these different colors in it. This one is mint. We have lipstick, coral, navy, lavender, this one is called Lemongrass, Blue Sage. I think I have two of the Blue Sage. Oh, that's another sampler. Light Gray, Plum, Mustard, Plum again, and then it looks like these are just variety packs. So I saw the question, what does it mean by removable? Literally that, if you place it, a lot of vinyl, if you place it, and your placement's off, it's stuck, and you're gonna have to remove it, and it's gonna tear. Um, well, these are gonna stay over here for now, because, oh, look at this. There's exclusive colors from Miss Martha. What? So this is a Martha Stewart. We can tell that because it says Martha Stewart on it. So this color is Caribbean blue, and it's also the removable matte. And she it looks like she has a few of her own colors that are different than the Cricut. So like this is Arrowhead. It's kind of a gray color. That just gives you all, I bet you these are only at Michael's. Premium Cricut plus Martha Stewart premium vinyl. This is ink blue. Ooh, pink flamingo. That's gorgeous. We have a nice gold color. And blue calico. Absolutely gorgeous. The last thing that I have in my box is the new Sports Flex. And I've gotten a lot of questions on the Sports Flex. What is the Sport Flex? What does it do? Um, and so the Sport Flex is for athletic, basically, um, clothes that are kind of stretchy. Like I like these shirts that um, when I wear like this one here, you can see the one I'm wearing right now, it stretches. See? Wah, wah, wah. So normally iron on on that, when you stretch it, it could rip off the shirt or crack. So this is their answer to that. It's the Sports Flex. So it's going to flex with it. And you'll know it's Sports Flex when you use it. You'll feel the stretch in it and stuff. So let me see if I can open this one for you guys before we're done. And then I legit got to go to my appointment or I'm gonna get in trouble. So this stuff, like I said, is 
Well, man, we got a lot of tape, don't we? Lots of tape. So here it is, another piece of tape. I don't want to cut it, but. So it's got a really flex to it, and I can't really show you without taking it off the carrier sheet, which I can do. I'll do that for my Pete, my crew. I'll take it off there so you guys can see. Oops, I turned that backwards, didn't I? There we go. So, the stuff, when you see how it flexes, so it's, it, it gives it. So, that way when you are putting it on a shirt that has that flex, you're not going to ruin your vinyl. Uh, how much is in a roll? It is three sheets. It's 11.8 by 12. The ones they gave me are, you can see the colors right here. Really pretty colors. So um, people will compare this. There's other stuff on the market. I think that's called um, uh, stretch or stuff like that. So it's the same kind of concept as that stuff. Ooh, look at this one, you guys. It's got like a pearl, it's hard to see, but it's got like a pearlescent look. It goes from blue to purple, no matter how you turn it. That's really cool. So that is everything I wanted to show you. Lots of good stuff. I gave you the links all down below so you could kind of take a peek at everything. Um, what I love about this release, let me see if I can turn the camera up. Sorry for those that get seasick. I don't want you guys to get too seasick. Oh, what's up, peeps? Um, what I really like about this is, wow, those lights are bright. Just a sec. So for me, what uh, is, I love about this release is it tells me Cricut is listening to their customers. Um, I remember when vinyl first came out with Cricut and with um, the iron-on, and there was a lot of talks in the group about this isn't high quality, I don't like it, and they actually did a whole study group. They reached out to customers and said, well, don't you like about it? Does it not wee? Does it you know, not go through the wash? And they reformulated it, and now they've reformulated it again. So they're listening to the customers and providing us really good options. So you're gonna have everyday iron on, you're gonna have premium, you're gonna have the premium vinyl, you're gonna have permanent, all these great options. And from what I've heard, this is just the beginning, which is awesome. So I know it wouldn't have been crazy. I was gonna try to do this in the car and there was just no way it was gonna happen. <laughs> no way at all. So there you guys are. There is everything I wanted to show you. Lots of good stuff. Go check it out. Um, this is new stuff. So unfortunately you can't use the KK10, but you can also double check to see if it does go on sale. Some of this stuff, I would say though, it might be a while because this is pretty popular stuff, especially the self-healing cutting mats. I really like those. Um, self-healing cutting mats and I love that pattern vinyl. I love the fusible fabric. And that iron on it is really nice. It's really thick. I can't really tell you, um, besides in person when you feel it, that it just feels different. It feels very, very premium is the only way I can put it. But it, it, it reminds me of, not to name drop to other brands, but you know, like when you go to the store or Joann's and they used to have, I don't know if they still do have Oracle, but they would have Oracle and you could tell the difference. It's up to that quality. I love it. So I can't wait to see what else is coming um because i'm telling you what when cricket came out with the explorer it was like the cricket explorer they didn't have a lot they had some paper look at everything we can get at cricket now we can get our cardstock our iron on our vinyl we can get um stuff for fabric now we have fabric and fusible fabric and all the cutting tools for it it's pretty impressive 
What I love about it is they're just listening to their customers. Um, it's all stuff that customers said, hey, I would love to have it. Um, and for me, I love it because it's like a one-stop shop. We can go get tools. I haven't got my hands on a true control blade yet. My Michaels has been out of them for months. I don't know if they've ever gotten them in and when they did get them in, they might've ran out of them really quick. I keep checking because I would love to test that true control blade. I think that true control blade is very ingenious on how you can replace the blade without actually touching the blade, which is really cool. So I want to get that because you guys all know right now I've been using pen blades, which is, you know, it's a great blade. I love it. So I want to see if it's going to replace pen blade in my opinion. Um, so anyways, that will be something there. So, all right guys, sorry this was a long Ken from the not car. I will be back from Ken from the car next week. Oh, I probably won't. <gasps> I won't be back for two weeks, guys. Because I'll be at convention next week. Next Wednesday is the first day of my chocolate tour convention. I'll see if I, I might do a live with my people. Um, so I'm going down with a whole bunch of friends of mine and, and my team. So maybe we'll do a live and just say, what's up peeps? What's up crew? Um, so I won't be back till the official car for two weeks. Uh, so it won't be this Wednesday, but the next Wednesday. Maybe we'll just go sit in someone's car at the hotel. Would that be random? Me go up to someone's hotel and say, hey, can I have the keys to your car? <laughs> <laughs> and they'd be like, why? And I was like, I seriously, all I, I'm not going to drive it. I'm just going to sit in there and do a video. And they'd be like, uh, hotel security, we need you down here now. <laughs> seriously. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining. I hadn't planned on opening all those packages like that, but I'm glad I did. So you guys could actually see everything and, and kind of get a feel for it. Um, definitely get some of that uh, printed uh, or uh, pattern vinyl or HTV, I love it, or iron on, sorry, see HTV, iron on, it's all over the place. So, and check out all the new stuff down below by using those links. Like I said, it helps support us and we are very appreciative of that. But I gotta get going. I have an appointment in 15 minutes. Don't wanna miss it. I'll get charged. So, thank you so much for staying with us through the whole time. I hope you enjoyed seeing the new stuff. Can't wait to share it with you in my lives and do projects with it. And I ultimately can't wait to compare. I know for you guys, Money is everything, um, so you know you are on a budget. So, is this self healing mat really going to be two times? You know, is it is it better than what I can get at a maybe a lower price point? So I want to show you guys that so you can make the right decision based on what's in your craft room. So, all right, guys, thank you so much. I love my entire crew. You guys are amazing. Um, Lynn says, can you use your code. I put several of the things you showed in my cart and took it all off. Well, I will not advertise that. Because <laughs> I don't know if that's supposed to happen. <laughs> so, um, but if it does, I will report it and take advantage of it, I guess. I don't know. Um, maybe, I don't know how, maybe how it works. I thought it was machines, new items, and bundles. So maybe some stuff isn't considered new. I don't know what their definition of new is. So maybe their new is like two weeks. I don't know. I should check on that and, and figure that piece out um, and stuff. So, uh, take advantage of it now then get use the code and have an amazing day. I adore all of you crew. Bye. Thanks for joining me on this long Ken from the not car. Adios guys.